What's up guys, Zach and Ashley Scott here playing Batman the Enemy Within. How are you doing, Ashley? I'm good, how are you? I'm great. Uh, today uh, we're going to be playing this game because it's coming out very soon and Telltale provided me an advanced copy. I can play a little bit of it now, a little bit when it, right before it launches, so we're going to do what we can now and uh, you know, later on when it launches, we'll do the rest, right? And uh, this is pretty cool. <laughs> so how did you like the first Batman game compared to the other Telltale games? It was good. It was a mixture of things that worked and other ones, I think. Yeah. I like the character. I, I always liked the Batman universe. And I thought the Telltale, the, the, the Telltale version of the Batman universe did a superb job with it. And a lot of it was really surprising in, in the direction that they took it. And I was just really surprised with... Um, you know, with what, like basically Wayne being like, and his family being the bad guys in a way, mm -hmm. and then his, you know, his relationships and stuff with, um, you know, Selena Kyle, for example, and Harvey Dent, I thought were done really well. And they barely introduced the Joker in the first one. They introduced him, is what I mean, but he, he wasn't quite yet the villain. So uh, I hear he might make an appearance. I don't know about this episode, but, you know, there's several different episodes coming. Right now, we're going to be, start, be starting episode one. I already have my save file synced. The reason I say that he'll be appearing is if you look, there's a little silhouette of the Joker right there. I mean, that's him. That's Catwoman. I don't know who these people are. And uh, I'm not quite sure. That, that almost looks like a Batman-Joker fight. But who's this right here? Let's find that's, out. Are you ready? I mean, is it spoiler from last time? What? I know. Who, we know who that is. Or I think that we know well, who that is. I don't know. Let's go ahead and click start episode one. Get this going. We don't get to check out my decisions, but this is based off of my. Uh, uh, I think it might be the Riddler. This is the Enigma, but ah, uh, the question mark, yeah. And there's a kind of a question mark, almost shaped. But I don't know. Let's start episode one. Let's see how this goes. Uh, maybe we'll get a recap of last time. I don't know. We'll find out though. I should hope so. Here we go. One fateful night, my parents gave their lives for me. They became my heroes, their legacy untouchable. Until I learned the truth. My father, Thomas Wayne, was a criminal. He ruled over Gotham from the shadows. And everything I thought I knew about myself changed forever. The children of Arkham exposed the truth about my father to Gotham. Their attack turned friends into enemies and threw the city into chaos. I was committed to Arkham Asylum, where I escaped with the help of a mental patient named John Doe. After a bloody battle, I put an end to it all in the catacombs beneath the city. The Penguin, Two-Face, and Lady Arkham were the first real challenge I faced as the Batman, but they would not be the last. Da -da -da. Kind of a, just Spring a... has arrived in Gotham, and with it comes City Hall's quarterly crime report. Crime is way down since the fall of the children of Arkham, marking another triumph for newly minted police commissioner James Gordon. In a statement this morning, Gordon credited his success to the public partnership between the police and the Batman. He praised the mysterious vigilante for his sacrifice, describing him as essential to the security of the city. Things are Ooh. looking up, citizens. After the long, dark <laughs> winter comes the thaw. Now, if only the Knights could win a game, everyone would be happy. What's in the box, Ashley? If only it could have been Jim Carrey's The Riddler. <laughs> Lucky 13! There it is, my Rumi Mori, import-export magnet, one-time Pipex CEO. International arms dealer. The world sees Maury as a legitimate businessman. A philanthropist who gives to charity. Not a criminal getting rich off the suffering of innocence. A masterful performance. <laughs> Did he even drink anything? I wonder if a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? What do you think, Master Bruce? Must be hard to stay true to yourself. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I never forget what drives me. <laughs> Protecting the innocent from people like Maury. I already didn't know what to say. the same no matter what mask I wear. Don't I know? Masks are hard to maintain. If there are cracks in Maury's, we'll find them. The 
GCPD already bugged his penthouse and found nothing. Meaning that if he's doing arms deals in Gotham... They happen on the casino floor. I need to find a way to hear what Maury is saying. Standing by for support. Look for something with a microphone. Hotel security are guarding him particularly close. A man like Maury counts more enemies than friends. I wonder why that is. Look at the roulette table. Oh, looks like roulette is his Achilles heel. He has a reputation for being lucky. But then you don't need luck when you own the house. True. Oh, look at Maury's... It's got to be Maury's cell phone. Let's look at Maury first before we do anything else. Look at all them gathered around here. He certainly enjoys the good life, doesn't he? Made a fortune running guns during the Arab Spring. Diversified into biotech shortly after. From what I understand, he's not one for pinching pennies. Ashley, what's your favorite casino game? Ugh. Not <laughs> going in. <laughs> Avoiding them. You don't like the uh, the uh, the fog of smoke. You might as well just throw your money out Consumer the window on your way. Could be a good way to hear Maury's conversation. All right, let's listen in. Let's hack his cell phone. Al, I'm hacking into Maury's phone. Encrypting your signal. Last thing we want is for him to know you're here. We're in. You should be able to pick up audio from Maury's phone. Is everyone enjoying themselves? Don't worry. I won't tell anyone with a bad. He's on a roll. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before he gets too chatty. This seems morally wrong. Try to blend in. <laughs> it's okay. Batman plays it loose with morals. Hey, I'm Bruce Wayne. Deal me in. So, I've been sitting over there wondering, what's Bruce Wayne doing in a place like this? Look at my ear. I figured you went to fancier casinos. I'm looking for something different. New thrills. Well, it's a good thing you're here. And it's a good thing I'm here. Why is that? You? What in the hell are you doing here? Oh, Jesus. Stop me if you've heard this one before. I begin and have no end. And I end all that begins. Who am I? I don't give a damn. I told you ten times. Our arrangement is over. Death, Mori. I am death. Something's happening, and it doesn't look like a deal. The man in the hood. I remember him from your father's time. I think that's Riddler. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, Jesus. Is something wrong? Yeah, the dude has you a gun. distracted. Yeah, leave me alone. Bruce. Go you away. Think your gibberish intimidates Come me. Hello. Him. You Stay close and keep your head down. Excuse me? <laughs> Bullets are about to fly. Okay. What? No one Why threatens you... me in my own I casino. thought we were leaving Security! somehow. Sir, it's time to leave. For you? An easy one. What question can you never answer yes to? I don't give a crap. Let's go. <sighs> Wrong. The correct answer is are you dead? Oh, Jesus. Yeah, that's a bad thing. Now, let's get started. Uh-oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. I'm trapped in here. Get out of there. Get your suit. Yeah, no, no joke. No joke, Alfred. Fun fact, Maury Al, means let Gordon death. know what's happening. Right away. Hey, no one leaves. I leave. There we go. Oh, nice. Oh, he's got a gun. Oh, you got a gun, do you? I have body head slam in the ground. I look like James Bond. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I think that's the idea. <laughs> Run now. What you did to that man, knocking him out like that. Oh my god, go. How did you do that? Fuck it's off, called lady. martial arts. I a different impression of you from TV. You never seemed that capable. I said run. If you stay, you'll die. 
Thank you. <laughs> Jeez. He's like, oh, okay, I guess. <laughs> Commissioner Gordon on the line, scrambling audio now. Gordon. Batman, what's the status? Here's my car. Looks pretty sweet. What's everybody Multiple worried about? Gunmen, hostages with, at the uh, casino. Self driving cars. Batman's had one for decades. A madman in a mask. I don't know. It seems to work pretty well, too. Riddler's back in Gotham. Riddler? He hasn't been seen in years. Well, he's putting on quite a show. Put it on. Yeah, gear up, dude. Go. <laughs> There's a squad on the way. He's just taking Don't his time. Yeah, how long can Be you ready stand for there? A fight. <laughs> Are you ready for a fight? I'm ready for a fight. The Riddler is starting off strong. Please, please. We can make the deal. Anything you want. Our issues can't be solved with handshakes, Maury. This is what happens when you back out of a deal with me. Oh, Jesus. There's only one way you're getting out of this alive. Solve the you puzzle. You solve a riddle. Oh, God. And I'd choose my words carefully if I were you. Listen closely. No, please, don't do this. Without fingers, I point. Without arms, I strike. Without feet, I run. Who am I? I don't need visual. It's a clock. That drone fully functional. Yeah. I'll need a place to drop in without being noticed. All Time right. for some recon. Let's do some recon, baby. It's a tricky one, isn't it? A mind bender. Riddler. A terror from the past. I never thought I'd see him on our streets again. He's not to be taken lightly. It's the kind of conundrum that drives. Some kind of torture device. Doesn't seem like he's getting out until he guesses the riddle. This Riddler certainly has an imagination. Oh, it never gives you a moment's peace. Believe me. Hey, Riddler's taken hostages, casino patrons, innocent bystanders. Uh, they're clearly not his main target. Must be an insurance policy. Okay. What else am I looking for? Don't think you can just stop. Like that dude's dead. I will get bored. You won't like that. Cashier's booth. That'll do. Just need to take out the guard first. Let's we'll shoot the guard with the drone. Audio playback fully functional. Time for a distraction. <laughs> He's got the quietest drone in existence. Doesn't sound like a lawnmower. Oh, here we go. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> That's so scary. <laughs> I would scream if I saw Batman. Patience, Maury. Are you expecting a hint? Give me an answer. What do I do? What do I do? Batman, we can't get in. The front's covered by gunmen, and they've got the back barricaded with blackjack tables. How should I deploy when we're inside? I'm relying on your eyes and ears. Mm -hmm. What's the best course of action? Gear up. Make a frontal assault. Try and draw their fire away from me. You got it. I thought tear gas might hurt the innocents. You're completely insane. No. I don't believe that's it. That's not the answer. Oh my god. Uh, I'll clear a path. Wait for my signal. Give them hell. We're counting on you. Here we go, Ashley. Oh, shit. Oh, I don't know what I did. Uh, <laughs> gotcha. Nice. I just hit, I just mashed the button. You're a natural. Uh, tear off or slam in. Oh, roulette wheel. This looks cool. Here we go. Yeah. Batman. I'm the Captain America. It's You're me. Ahead of schedule. I'm a little busy right now, but I'll see if I can fit you in. Not him, the hostage. Shoot the hostage. No, 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 no. no. Do not shoot the hostage. That would be a bad thing. Anchor the gun. Anchor the here the gun. Let's go for the gun. Oh shit. Uh, Q E. There we go. I hit them both. Okay, this is a lot of controlling. <laughs> there we go. That's what I wanted to do. He's running. I'm dodging. Hiya, bats. 
Hey. That man clearly isn't using his head. Break it open. What? With pleasure. <laughs> Why do you have a giant wrench? Uh, no thanks. No thanks. That's his thing. He's just a wrench kind of guy. <laughs> Maybe there were complaints about it being too easy, so there's more fun combinations. Uh, what the hell is this? You know, your bat buttons. <laughs> Left and right. Uh, shock him. Yeah! <laughs> I've heard stories in the streets about you, Batman. You're the biggest name in Gotham since... Well, since I left town. Why? Why? Everyone's very impressed with you. How did this even happen? <laughs> I'm not impressed. Gotham's criminals so you're have become of, zealots and thugs he's in part cheap of everyone. suits. And you, I've come home to find a wannabe in my chair. Oh yeah, a wannabe. Eating my goddamn porridge. This is my city. Gotham has forgotten you, Riddler. Crawl back under your rock before you get hurt. <laughs> Says the man with a hook at his throat. Oh, I got a computer. You're supposedly the world's greatest detective. True. But here you are. Gordon, no. Now. I'm my... Oh, shit. You have to be kidding. No, no joke. Clever. But not smart enough. All right. Watch out. Down. Let me show you how it was done back in the day. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. People are shooting. He's smiling. What the heck is this? He throw a glass at me? As if that's gonna work? Oh! Nice. <laughs> Gordon just punched him. And I'm walking off calm and smooth. Crawling like a common street hood. <laughs> okay. This doesn't do it for me. Oh. oh my god. Uh, you're in trouble, dude. Okay. Follow the power lines. There must be a weak point. There it is. Slice it. Nice. I sort of saved you. Not your fingers, though. So some of them are gone. Probably a clean cut. Most likely can be reattached. Really? You broke the cage. That's cheating. Think I care about your rules? I'd heard you were a man who followed a code. Why would you save that dirtbag's life? Maury made his money running guns. I believe in justice. Maury deserves a trial in a court of law. If he's guilty, his cell will be right next to yours. Justice? Ridiculous. Either way, you won't be the one to put me there. Why not me? Oh, there we go. Nice. Oh. I mean, really. What, what the hell? What, what, do I, what do I do? How do I get out of this? What did I hit? <laughs> what did I. <laughs> All right, I, I, I brought up the steam overlay accidentally. Uh, what is that? There we go. Uh, roundhouse sounds cool. Enough of this. You have charges placed you know anywhere? You scrap. I'll give you that, but it's not enough. Let's see how you do with something a little more cerebral. Better hurry, detective. Solve my puzzle soon. Or people are gonna get hurt. And we know you can't let that happen. Jesus. And stay out. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Uh, Q, Q, E, E. There we go. Yeah, here, go, do it. Uh, 
the new mechanics are kind of throwing me off a bit, but also I earlier when I was like confused, I hit the steam overlay. That's what happened. Y'all saw it. Nice, nice, nice. Electric bullets. Who is this? Who, who are you these people? Look like before Christian going Bale. Waller. After all, we're here to help. Who is Waller? I forget. All right, all in a day's work. That was the intro to Batman: The Enemy Within. Uh oh, someone else is encroaching on Batman's territory, <laughs> meeting out justice as he sees fit. Yeah. I believe in justice, Batman style. You would think somebody whose whole life is riddles would come up with some, you know, new ones, not tired old ones Circuitry that everyone knows inside, the answer to. But nothing obviously He's an dangerous. old man. The back computer will be able to analyze further. Okay, well, I guess we'll just take it. I can't just leave it, so I'll take it. Puzzle box. Is that one word? I don't know. This one is. <laughs> All right. Your days are numbered, bat freak. Okay. We'll see each other again. Yeah, yeah, yeah whatever. Watch Keep your mouth. Keep one eye on the sky, jerk-offs. Heavens are gonna fall on your goddamn heads. Tell me all about it down at the precinct. Yeah. The Riddler's right hand in custody. Not a bad result, all told. Riddler used to leave clues at all his crime scenes. Always thought he was smarter than the people trying to catch him. Thought we could use help dragging him down. He got a sick pleasure out of taunting us. That's because he hadn't met me. That's for <laughs> damn sure. He's taking advantage of You don't of know how glad I am you're here. <laughs> yeah. Working with the police. Riddler's heyday was a dark time in Gotham. Remember what we just saw? He hasn't mellowed with age. Uh-huh. Get Fernandez on it right away. So he's doing like an old Commissioner man. Commissioner Gordon. Old man Brace Riddler. Yourself. Just so you know, this woman has a lot of juice with the governor. Rub her the wrong way, I could end up on foot patrol till I retire. All My rubber... people are trained for situations like so this, good. Gordon. We'd have Riddler in custody if you'd only picked up the phone. I didn't hear a ring. So, you're the legendary Batman. I've heard a great deal about you. So much so, I don't know if I should believe the hype. I haven't had the pleasure of an introduction, Miss... A pleasure, huh? Most people don't <laughs> usually call it that. This is Amanda Waller, director of the agency. What are the feds doing here? Riddler's their case. The GCPD has been asked to open our doors to them, give them whatever they need. We've been tracking that maniac for some time. No one knows more about him than we do. World-class criminals like Riddler, they're kind of our specialty. If you were tracking him, why didn't you tell us he was coming? Boom, roasted. get a lot roasted. of unverified reports. <laughs> I wanted to be sure. Now we know. <laughs> Riddler used to be a player in Gotham back when Thomas Wayne and Falcone ran the city. He disappeared so suddenly and for so long, everyone thought he was dead. Everyone was wrong. Riddler's back. And if these theatrics are anything to go by, he wants the whole city to know. My people tell me you did some good work handling him, Batman. You and me? I bet we'd make a damn fine team. I heard how you dealt with Lady Arkham. Not to mention that filth. Good Oswald idea. Cobblepot. It's a good idea. We could Silence. do great things together if we joined Sorry. forces. <laughs> Don't worry. You'll come around. I don't have to say anything. The only real problem with your setup is who you're working with. Local law enforcement clearly can't cut it. I got a local crime rate says otherwise. <laughs> Ms. Waller... Please, Commissioner. What was that charge of the light brigade crap with the riot shields? Good cops got hurt because of it. Not to mention you let Riddler slip through your fingers. You GCPD cowboys clearly don't know what you're doing. Rude. You're putting all this on me? You're the commanding officer, aren't you? Or are those stars purely Back for off. show? Back off, Waller. Don't blame the police, blame Riddler. Or hadn't you noticed he was the one cutting off fingers? Oh, I noticed, all right. Just like I noticed you let him get away. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm here to prevent this incompetence in the future. 
I gotta get a security detail on Mori while he's in the hospital. Agent Avesta will fill you in on what we know so far. As a token of interdepartmental cooperation. She's a token. The nerve on her. Don't tell these people a thing, especially about that puzzle. Okay. This is our town. We're the ones that'll catch Riddler. Okay. Isn't that kind of Oof. bad attitude? I thought she was gonna bite your head off for a second. Uh, I'd like to see her try. Special Agent Imana Vesta, Field Intelligence Specialist on the Riddler case. And my partner, Agent Blake. How do you do? I put together this psychological profile of Riddler. You'll see when you read it. He's... changed. For your eyes only. <laughs> if you catch my drift. Doesn't he look like Christian Bale? The target of the casino attack, Rumi Mori. Any idea what Riddler wanted with him? Why are they we treating... figure it has something to do with why he's back in Gotham. I heard them talking about some kind of deal. Any idea what? No. But it'd be safe to say they didn't come to terms. How come that's for my eyes only? Like, Thanks. why do they treat me that's so special? Help. Like, what are the feds? Like, they just trust Batman. Yeah, the legendary Batman. <laughs> I'm Gotham born and raised, you know. My dad ran a store in the shadow of City Stadium. I just wanted to say it's a real honor to meet you. <laughs> I do have something I want to ask, though. The criminally insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? There's something in you that pulls you towards the danger. They're drawn to him. You can't go two city blocks in Gotham without tripping over criminal scum. Most people just get up and run away. I'm not most people. Booyah. I think I know you a little better now. Uh, what'd you just type in? <laughs> I'll be in touch. Agent. Batman, before you go, um. Gotham's your city. I respect that. But you should know I don't have to play nice. Me neither. I'm letting you hunt the Riddler for now. You better share everything you find. Or... This courtesy call is going to become something you really won't like. You get me? <laughs> yeah, I like that. That's a cool move. <laughs> All right, the Enigma. Pretty cool so far, right? Mm -hmm. Good intro thus far. Wayne Manor. Behind the hedges, under the ground. Lies. The Bat Cave. The Rat Cave. Daddy's <laughs> home. <laughs> I drive in at like 90. <laughs> like, just slam him. <laughs> All right. I'm glad to be back in this universe. What uh, an eventful evening. I've taken the liberty of preparing some refreshments. What is that garbage uh, offered? So. <laughs> I need to focus. Maybe music will help. <laughs> what? Stand Amb here and crank it, Alfred. Uh, ambient. Something with a beat. Yeah. It's an old ambient record. <laughs> <laughs> the computer is finished scanning the Riddler's puzzle box. It's ready when you are. Let's get to work. I can barely hear the ambient music. It's also a crank. And no one's cranking it. Does it stop? I can't even hear the... You have to stand there and crank it. <laughs> Look at Catwoman oh. any day. Uh, Selena. She'll turn up again. I'm looking forward to it. All right. Sparring with her. Is that what he calls it? <laughs> These are my trophies. Lady Arkham. Like a serial killer would have. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, Selina Kyle came to Gotham to perform a number of robberies for the children of Arkham, though she eventually helped me stop them. She left Gotham during Lady Arkham's final assault on the city, and I don't know whether she'll ever return. Despite our differences, I enjoyed sparring with her. Wink. <laughs> Two-Face. Harvey Dent was once a promising uh, mayoral candidate... And one of my closest friends. I supported his campaign and his vision for Gotham. After he was attacked by the children of Arkham, he became Two-Face, a violent and deeply paranoid criminal. During his brief stint as mayor, he used his authority to enforce martial law throughout the city. 
And he attacked Wayne Manor. So lame. Oswald Cobblepot was a terrorist, anarchist, and my oldest friend. <laughs> Born to one of Gotham's most... How come I'm friends with all these people who just go crazy? <laughs> Born to one of uh, Gotham's most prestigious families, he lived abroad after his mother was committed to Arkham Asylum by my father. He returned to Gotham to join the city of Arkham, children of Arkham, seeking revenge on my family for destroying his. Understandable. Lady Arkham. Vicki Vale was a well-known and respected reporter at the Gotham Gazette, but she was born Vicki Arkham, a victim of my father's criminal activities. She created her alter ego, Lady Arkham, and her terrorist organization, the Children of Arkham, to destroy Gotham's elite. I defeated her, but I don't know if she's alive or dead. Her body was never found. <laughs> That's a clue. Okay, let's back out of there. That's cool. I'm glad. <laughs> I like how I have these. Oh, I have room for more. <laughs> Gotta rack them up. Still young. <laughs> Oh, that's great. I like that a lot. I'm going the long way to the computer. <laughs> I can barely hear my ambient music. All right, what did it find? No explosives detected, no radioactivity. Nothing dangerous at all so far. Computer, run another scan. I want to be absolutely sure this thing is safe. Also... I took the liberty of digging up everything I could find on the agency. Why did you do that, Alfred? <laughs> There's plenty here. Know your enemy and all that. Parkinson's acting up. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. It, it comes and goes. Ever since the kidnapping and, and all the other business with Lady Arkham. Alfred. <clears throat> no, no. Don't you worry about me. <laughs> I wasn't. Uh, uh, I should be fine. It was worse after my first tour of duty. Your family, Alfred. We worry about family. And that's it. Thank you, Bruce. But I'm not increasing your insurance benefits. <laughs> <It'll> pass. <laughs> Working always helps. Well, then get to work, Alfred. You don't need therapy. <laughs> <laughs> not at all. Or medication. Never. All right. Well, here we go. We're going to look at the... Uh, let's look at the Gotham feed really quick. Gotham citizens support GCPD Batman partnership. What choice do they have? Despite some heavy <laughs> criticism from elected officials, the Gotham City Police Department's public partnership with the mass vigilante known as Batman has been a rousing success with the city's population. Across the board, crime in Gotham, City's, Gotham City limits has been down from the previous year, with violent crimes hitting a record low. Well, when they go from a record high, <laughs> it shouldn't be that hard <laughs> yeah, to bring yeah. them back down. <laughs> But hey, I'm claiming that as a, as a success. <laughs> Those they're still higher than they were 10 years ago, but... But still, no, they're great now. <laughs> Though some on the... If they're, if they're too low, Batman can't do anything. He'll be bored. Though some on the city council have raised concerns about Batman's hidden identity and his operation outside the restrictions of the law, it doesn't appear to be hurting public opinion. How mean. I don't care who he is. I care that he makes things safer, said grocery store owner Wayne Barton, whose business has seen a 50% spike in sales after dark in recent months. Boo, yellow journalism. Council member Gail Rich is sympathetic to business owners like Barton, but she maintains until we know who this Batman is, I don't think we can ever be truly safe. Boo. Side note, Wayne Enterprises stock hits record high. <laughs> Coincidence? Wayne Enterprises stock hit a record high of $120 per share. Today, during afternoon trading, surpassing its previous high of 115 per share over a year ago. The record high is the latest event in the company's recent hot streak since Bruce Wayne returned to the company as CEO last year following his brief ouster. Uh, Wayne has was removed from the CEO position last year and replaced with Oswald Cobblepot in a move that resulted in Wayne publicly assaulting Cobblepot and, a brief, and briefly admitted to Arkham Asylum. Wayne has since claimed the assault was the side effect of a drug injection at the hand of former Gazette reporter Vicki Vale, who conducted criminal business under the name Lady Arkham. And of course, everybody is fair enough to yeah. understand the nuance <laughs> of that story. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dent trial date pushed back again. A federal judge has delayed the start of a former Gotham Mayor Harvey Dent's criminal trial by several more months following the departure of the defendant's entire legal team. The team, led by attorney Brandon Hoffman, announced they were recusing themselves in a pretrial hearing on Monday morning. Instead, Dent, who previously served as Gotham's d district attorney, has insisted on representing himself in the trial. In a statement uh, in court, Hoffman said, I no longer feel I can defend Mr. Dent to the best of my ability. 
Judge Harriet Stokes then moved to delay the trial by two more months while Dent prepared his case. This is the fourth delay to the trial and the third set of attorneys to part ways with Dent, who is facing multiple charges of murder, criminal ne ne negligence, and fraud. Gazette Investigation, what is the agency? It seems Batman is no longer the most mysterious crime fighter on the streets of Gotham City these days. Multiple sources from law enforcement have confirmed with the Gazette that a mysterious governmental entity known as the Agency has been conducting operations in the city recently. On the record, there is no evidence of any federal crime fighting organization by this name, but many sources who have requested an anonymity... Uh, uh, how do you say it? Anonymity. That's what I said. Have confirmed that the Agency has been present at several recent crime scenes and exert a considerable authority. I have no idea who these people are, but when they show up, they're in charge, one officer said. They act like they know what they're doing, but with no way to check their track record, I guess we have to take them at their word. Officials call, say, Cobblepot model prisoner. This is a long newspaper. I guess it's a news feed. In stark contrast with the ongoing saga of Harvey, Dent, Harvey Dent's legal battle, former Wayne Enterprises CEO and convicted domestic terrorist, <laughs> Oswald Cobblepot, is a model prisoner at Blackgate Prison. The man who briefly aligned himself with the terrorist organization Children of Arkham pleaded guilty to all charges against him earlier this year. He was sentenced to 40 years to be served in Blackgate. Observers and legal experts were surprised at Cobblepot's decision to forego a hearing in court, but from all accounts, he appears to be enjoying his new life in jail. He's probably running that place. We don't have a bad thing to say about him, said one Blackgate guard who wished to remain anonymous. Uh, you get to talking to him, and he's actually pretty charming. He's super smart. All of the news has to do with Batman. Yeah. No, nobody's talking about the new library. <laughs> nobody's talking about how uh, he Heifer the Hippo had a baby now the at the zoo. Oh, the news is just here to stress you out. The agency. <laughs> the public face of a shadow committee of military leaders, intelligence experts, and government officials. Civil rights violations, domestic black sites, decentralized accountability. This nice. information, it's all before Waller took over the director position. Perhaps she's given them a new direction. Maybe. As director. The agency's empowered to override local law enforcement with impunity. Oh, Batman's got some competition in town. I wonder if we need be worried. The Riddler's a flashy homicidal maniac with a thing for puzzles. And Waller and her agency might be just as dangerous. Again, Waller may be running a more <laughs> ethical operation these days. I don't know. Batman's a strong supporter of states' rights. <laughs> yes. Individual Hitler rights. Hitler terrorized this city long before you were Batman. Gotham's original costumed criminal. Yes, to have him returned, it's unsettling. I remember when he was the scourge of the underworld. Even Carmine Falcone gave him a wide berth. He was presumed dead for so long. Why come back to Gotham? Well, he seemed to have a prior relationship with Maury. Some kind of axe to grind. Let me upload the rest of this to the Codex. The agency realized Riddler was still alive when he orchestrated a prison break at Peña Duro. My men here say you let yourself oh. get caught, Mr. Yeah. Riddler. Just Riddler. Why willingly turn yourself in? Oh, Mr. Warden. To get everyone else out, of course. <laughs> that wasn't obvious. That's <laughs> deranged. You ask me, he needs help. In Arkham Asylum. He's clearly sick. <laughs> the mm. man is in urgent need of a doctor. I know just the place for him. <laughs> Plenty of room at Arkham Asylum. <laughs> Next to him, most of the inmates seem like a picture of health. Okay. Is he that crazy? That? You should see your face. It's confusion. It's delightful. I think I'll take it with me. Oh, <laughs> Riddler also likes to skin people. I take apparently. everything back. <laughs> everything? What do you mean, take everything back? What? Oh my god, yeah, this is a big old codex right here. What is all this stuff? Alright, well, I'm not going to read these out loud. Yeah, we only have so much time. I read the news. The Codex is an uh, interesting tidbit for when you guys play the game. You check out your Codex. It's a fun read. Let's see what Riddler's little gift is all about. Solve my puzzle soon or people will get hurt. Uh, Riddler's M.O. hasn't changed in all these years. All right. 
Open it up. Don't chop up my fingers. It's full of bad coffee. Oh, wow. That was cool. Okay. <laughs> that animation. <laughs> There's uh... writing engraved along the rim. I have an eye yet cannot see. Who am I? That sounds familiar. A potato. I've heard <laughs> it before. Don't happen to remember the answer, do you? Look it up on the computer. Sadly, no. Google it. I have an eye, but cannot see. A needle. Who am I? There's a needle. Blind justice. A one-eyed jack. Those bottom ones aren't. Let's try the eye of the needle. The eye of a needle. But how does that relate to the object in question? Maybe it's telling us how to use it. Uh, like a record. Sounds very plausible. You play it like a record. Mm -hmm. It looks like a record. Those strange grooves. <laughs> I got so it. So strange. So strange. Look at movie tickets. Very clever. <laughs> Never forget. <laughs> My own personal 9-11. <laughs> All right. See ya. Okay. But hey, finally now I can play something. See, that's why they had me even use the record. It'd be funny if they didn't even have me use the record player, then I would have like never even thought of it, really. Possibly. Play disc. Needle. Yeah. A record needle. There we go. Thank God I have this. Halfway there, Batman. Means you've got half a chance of stopping a whole lot of pain. To be honest, you're already doing better than I thought. But don't sit around feeling pleased with yourself unless you want to see me tear this city apart. What's the rest of it? Oh. I suppose you're going to look in there. An open invitation from the Riddler? Of course. The huh. tracking device? What? Looks like I'm manipulating radio bands or waveforms. Something. I'm not sure what I'm looking at or how any of it is actually displaying. Come on. And that sound. What? Oh, uh... I'm not really sure about any of it. <laughs> Get Lucius on the line, will you? Slow it down, speed it up. Uh, maybe it's a code. Hey, Alfred. <laughs> Good morning, Lucius. I hope we're not interrupting your breakfast. My youngest is probably stealing all the bacon, but duty calls. What's up? This is a puzzle from the Riddler. There's a strange waveform pattern I can manipulate inside that needs your expertise. I, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, I can meet you at Wayne Tower in a little bit. We'll, uh, fire up the R&D lab. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important, Lucius. No, no, don't worry about it. It's actually gonna be a big day for me. Tiffany starts at Wayne Enterprises. Tiffany? Really? Your daughter, working alongside you. How wonderful. Uh, certainly is. Bruce, I'll see you soon. Nepotism. Bye, Lucius. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to see Tiffany. <laughs> Your daughter, Tiffany. Can't wait to see her. <laughs> Take her out to celebrate. Have her come to my place oh. to celebrate. Good hunting, Bruce. Thanks. Well, here we go. It's a new game in town. It's the Riddler. Sadly. Probably my least favorite Batman villain. Yeah, probably. Mine too. But, you know, we'll see what happens with this one. Oh, excellent. Glad I caught you. I have some good news to share. Good to hear it, Regina. It's what I've come to expect, with you as Wayne Enterprises chairperson. <laughs> I just talked to the board, and they couldn't be more pleased with the progress of the Arkham remodel. Seems like you made the right call when you decided to take that contract over the GCPDs. The Gazette's running a piece about it. Look, I would love to hear all the details, but I've got a meeting with Lucius I've got to run to. Well, I don't mean to pry, but what's in that case? You're prying. <laughs> Seems like an odd thing to be carrying around the office. 
Oh, this? Oh. This is just something for Lucius. <laughs> I see. <laughs> well, I've got a meeting I've got to run to. We'll pick up this conversation this afternoon. Sounds great. <laughs> Sounds great. Sounds great. Bye-bye. So they're letting, after all that his family's been involved in, they're letting Wayne Enterprises still run our You're in my chair. <laughs> the Just state mental facility. Just updating the encryption on your bat tech. Our city. But if you want me to stop, no, the seat is all yours. But um, this is the thing you were talking about. One of Riddler's puzzles, some kind of test. Show me. Do, do you happen to have a record player with you? Huh. Any <laughs> idea what he's planning? Not yet. That's why I need your help. I guess he doesn't need to hear the record if his part. His history is anything to go by. He left us a clue. A psychological profile of Riddler. Uh, knowing how his mind works, this should come in handy. No sign of explosives or poison. Already scanned for that in the cave. Here we go again. Cool. It's a record. Huh. Well, would you look at that? Micro pulse waveform. Ah, and the sound it's giving off. A signal, maybe? I couldn't decipher it. I was hoping you could help with it. Hey, go away! I'll see what I can do. Shouldn't take long. Oh, sh what the... What in the... It's not one of mine. Think fast. What the heck? Nobody's this... alarmed? This is Tiffany? Hi, Dad. <laughs> Tiffany? Tiffany's a robot? Hey, Bruce. Hey. Oh my God, Tiffany. My God. <laughs> it's been a while. Like <laughs> making out of orientation your first day. I just wanted to say hi to my new boss. I got you a present, a micro drone prototype I developed in my spare time. Thank High you. High end AV, stealth black shell, programmable for autonomous observation. Small, quiet, and super smart, just like its designer. Not bad, huh? You always had a thing for toys. So hard to know what to get a man who has everything. I love it. Thanks, Tiffany. Well, I guess it's not bad. <laughs> not bad. See what I had to deal with growing up? Huh. There's something different about you. That's my uh, ear. <laughs> there is. And I don't just mean what happened to your ear. Oh. I can't quite put my finger on it. But you look... You look... Old. I think the uh, the word you're looking for is badass. <laughs> um, no, that is definitely not what I meant. I'm the resident badass around here. Thank you very much. <laughs> you just said that out loud. Uh, see, Bruce, it's her first day, and I'm already embarrassing her. <laughs> Dad. Interesting. Don't. Too late. Already touching. Just be careful. What a strange thing. It's very strange. The circuitry Look. design. It's elaborate and unorthodox. Dog just almost intentionally so. Like whoever put it together was kind of showing off. Huh. Yeah. Micro pulse waves? Yep. It's just weird. Seriously, what is this thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's like whoever made it. Silence. <laughs> <laughs> I like silence as an option. Lucky I'm here to help. <laughs> uh, help with. Figure this freakish thing out. Uh, Tiffany did graduate first in her class at Cornell in molecular engineering. Let me take a crack at it. I can help you get to the bottom of this. She minored figure in puzzling. What, it does. <laughs> what should I do? Sure, sure whatever. Yeah, if you think you can help, then be my guest. Oh, I know I can help. I just gotta let him know that I won't be finishing up orientation. <laughs> no problem. Oh, I was planning on swinging by the manor after work to see Alfred. I heard he wasn't doing so well. That he was having some issues with his health? From whom? He would love that. <laughs> I hope he isn't still angered with me and Luke about that incident with the China. Well, you know, Al, no one messes with his dinnerware.
Thank you. Catch you guys later. <laughs> Welcome aboard, Tiffany. My God. Thanks, <laughs> boss. Sorry for flirting, Lucius. <laughs> All right. Just can't help myself. Time to crack this puzzle. I'm a playboy billionaire. I never told her, you know. Told her what I really do at Wayne Enterprises. What uh, we do. If you're willing to pull her into this Riddler project, why not consider bringing her into the fold? Into the mission? We're going to need help if we're going to be dealing with the likes of Riddler. And we can trust her. Well, do you know what she wants, Lucius? It's not for us to decide her future. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> it's just that our work means a great deal to me. It is up to I'd you like guys to, to decide <laughs> whether to let her in on it. <laughs> I, I didn't I was... put a pin in this for now. I think we've got enough on our plates. Well, shall we go down to the lab? Actually, the equipment we need is down in my office. We'll get this taken care of in no time. I was going to say, leave it up to her dad to decide whether he wants her involved in crime Mr. fighting. Wayne. Oh, God. Uh, yes. What? <laughs> I'm Special Agent Avesta. We've never met. This is my partner, Special Agent Blake. We've never met. Uh, well, I guess I'll see you in a bit. I'll be down in my office. I'll be down in a few. No worries. I'll, uh, start without you. First, got a snout Sorry for the unannounced visit. We're with the agency's behavioral analysis unit. We just came by to ask a few questions. <sighs> is this going to take long? It's not really a good time. I'm afraid this meeting isn't optional. What? You'll just have to put up with us for a few minutes. <laughs> it's not optional. What are you going to do to me? <laughs> oh, shit. Let me get ahead of this. Be cool, be this cool. Office, it really represents you. Well, I like to think so. <laughs> is this you? She's just here to yeah. do a psych eval on you. That's How all old? she does. I don't know, seven, eight, maybe. <laughs> so happy. After everything you've been through, I don't know how you still do it. But why are you do here? What, exactly. It wasn't long ago when you were the most hated man in Gotham, yet you still give so much back to the city. Why do you continue to help Gotham? Most people wouldn't be so charitable after that. How's it going down there? I uh, left that file on your desk. Think you could bring it down? I'll be down in just a second. Sorry about that. What were you saying? I was saying you're a bit of a mystery. What, uh, what is it you want? The agency recently brought me in to draft a psychological portrait of the Riddler. We've been tracking him for months, but haven't been able to find him. Fridler, that psycho from the news? <laughs> I thought you'd be interested, considering your history. What's my history? My, uh, my history? A lot of things happened to you last year, and not all of them were good. Everything was great last year. You put yourself you at say that risk about anybody. when you helped bring in your friend Harvey Dent. He was a violent psychotic at the time, almost destroyed the city. True. Come to think of it... You've been associated with quite a few psychopaths over the years. I wouldn't go that far. I would. The criminally insane, they seem drawn to you. No, they don't. Either that, or you're often in the wrong place at the wrong time. Yes, having money and fame makes you an easy target. I've had my fair share of crazies knocking on my door. Like this guy. I think you'd know him as John Doe. We understand that it was during your stay in Arkham where you and John met and became friends. No, we're not but friends. The sound of it, you two were close. You've got to be kidding me. He's no friend of mine. That's why you came here to ask me about that guy? According to hospital records, you and John were involved in a riot. They captured the whole incident on video. <laughs> John cut another inmate, a man named Victor Zaz, then you jumped into the fray. Yeah, that's Zaz's thing. He Several that. people were hurt. I was... I was trying to break up a fight. I don't blame you. You must have been scared. I was not scared. John was discharged <laughs> from Arkham months ago. Oh, good. No one has seen or heard from him since. I was thinking maybe you have. No, we're not that... <laughs> Why would you think that? 
he listed you as his emergency contact. <laughs> uh, sounds like you two were pretty close to me. Okay, now I'm a little creeped out. I knew him for, what, a day? Maybe you made an impression on him. Well, I haven't seen or heard from him, so... Did he do something wrong? He's a person of interest. You see, we've got a wall in the office with a bunch of photos pinned to it. Two-Face, Penguin, Lady Arkham, you know, Gotham's most notorious. They've got all these little strings connecting them to one another, like a web. Yeah, heard of it? and I'm in the center. And you, my friend, are at the center. Okay. You keep pretty strange company for someone who wants everyone to think they're such a stand-up guy. <laughs> and your point is what exactly? That I'm some kind of criminal mastermind? Or just really unlucky? I'm very lucky. <laughs> you know more than you're letting on, Mr. Wayne. Maybe you're afraid. Maybe you don't trust I, us. Of course I don't trust you. Or maybe you're a criminal. Like your father. Maybe you're not the hero people think you are. I am calling my lord. That's an evacuation warning. It's time for you to leave. We'll pick this up another time. Yeah, get out of here, pantsuit. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thanks so much for watching. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. This is Otto, Egon, and I'll see you next time for more.